All right, y'all, back at you. And today we're gonna be talking about Casarina trees. Yeah, Casarina trees right here. They're also called Australian pines, and these are uh, these are a non-native invasive species here in Florida. Um, they're called Australian pines, but they're they're not uh, conifers. They're they're actually angiosperms, um, and they were introduced to Florida um, from Australia. I think there's several different varieties, but uh, they are um, they are they are an invasive species here. Um, I'll show you why in just a minute. But it's actually they're so invasive that it's illegal in the state of Florida to possess one of these plants with the intent to plant it or distribute it. Um, and um, they they were originally introduced here um, as windbreaks. Uh, windbreaks for the citrus uh, industry and then also for uh, timber and for uh, shoreline stabilization um, I believe but they turned out to be terrible for shoreline stabilization they I, I believe they have a shallow root system that uh, that prevents other uh, native plants with better root systems from growing and you'll see they also shade out uh, virtually all uh, native plants. We'll go in here and you'll see what it looks like in here. You can see when we get inside here, there is literally nothing growing down here. They just shade out everything. And this is not what uh, your typical maritime uh, forest looks like in our area. This is, this is a pretty desolate looking ground cover right here. Um, they're real pretty. They definitely look cool, but uh, this is not one you want to plant in Florida um, because they're just so invasive and they grow so fast. Actually, though, my son here has his own YouTube channel called Casarina Kids. Yeah, and we named it that because we're at one of our favorite parks here, and he likes playing in these trees, yeah. and so that's that's why he named his channel that. But uh, we just I just wanted to show everybody what these look like. I'm sure you've seen them. I'll step back. They get massive. They get real big. You can see Teddy down there. You can see along this whole uh, kind of field line here. They're, they're by far the biggest tree. And um, they are just, they're not good for our local environment here. So. If you see one on your property or in your yard, we would encourage you to get rid of it, right? Unfortunately. Yeah. Anyways, y'all, I hope you liked our video. Hope you found it informative. If you did, I finally learned how to put a subscribe button. Uh, I think it's in this corner, maybe this one, I don't know. But uh, if you liked our video, we'd appreciate it if you'd consider subscribing to our channel. And if you don't, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? You won't be able to get rid of these oh no that's no good they're just gonna keep growing and growing and growing and growing and all you'll have is uh, australian pines on your property so uh maybe consider subscribing to our channel until next time y'all everybody take care